Hopefully someone can hear me right now, but I finally saw Upside, which is a remake of uh, the great French film Antouchab. <laughs> this time it doesn't have Omarcy, it's Francois Cousset, it has Kevin Hart and Brian Cranston who, you know, have their own little quirks and charms. I mean, Kevin Hart was pretty good in Get Hard and then Brian Cranston has always been great with Malcolm in the Middle, Breaking Bad, and he also done the voice of the uh, key dog in Isle of Dogs. Um, both uh, you know, pretty, give uh, pretty good performances and you definitely feel for the characters there. But overall, it is not the original. The only reason why I saw it was because someone paid my, a ticket to see it for free. So I saw it with a friend. Other than that, I really couldn't care about, you know, if they've done a remake of that. Because I'm perfectly fine with seeing the original Antushab, you know, on DVD, on streaming services, with no uh, grimace or hassle. Um, in other words, I don't want to get too long-winded about this, but I thought it was a little unnecessary but it wasn't as bad as I assumed it would be because when I firstly heard about it and I saw Transfer, I thought, this is going to be terrible. It's going to be the worst thing ever. But you know what's going to be worse than that? Lion King, Aladdin, that Dumbo film that just came out recently, Child's Play, Men in Black International. Those reboots and remakes will be a lot worse than Upside. I can give you the guarantee of that right now. I just might include Upside on my list compared to all those other remakes, which I don't even plan on seeing. I just will say, nope, not interested. If you want to pay a ticket for me to go see it, I refuse. That'll be all. This is Skinny Ebert signing off. Until then, keep on watching.